Hold the phone, Telstra shares hit a six year high. Elon Musk says pull the plug on AI. And the Perth band creating NFTs so they can afford to eat. Welcome to Trading Up, a collaboration by the West Australian and Graffa. I'm Heidi Cuthbert. If you're Australian, there's a good chance you own Telstra shares, either directly or through your super fund. Today, Telstra shares have surged to their highest level in six years. So why did this happen? Well, Goldman Sachs upgraded the shares to a price target of $4.50. One of the reasons for the upgrade, Telstra has introduced rational pricing, which means it's made its mobile phone plans responsive to inflation. And that means if you can't afford your bill because of cost of living pressures, Telstra will make it cheaper for you and retain you as a customer. The information technology sector drove the gains on the market today and the biggest company in this sector, of course, is Telstra. Much of this sector was also higher with Block, Webit Nano, Iris and Xero, all in the green. Narrowing in on another tech stock, shares of Zip have surged today after a $20 million windfall from selling its businesses in Central and Eastern Europe and South Africa. Zip said the ventures in these countries, as well as the Middle East, have been operating at a loss and they've been weighing heavily on the buy now, pay later company's profits. Shares of rare earths play West Cobar Metals have hit a whole bunch of Graffa's data triggers today after the company announced positive drill results from its Salazar project in WA. It was one of the most wanted stocks traded on the ASX today. Also, rare earths company RareX had positive drill results, which sent its shares soaring. And kind of related to Rare Earth's solar tech company Strategic Elements also saw shares spike after it announced a technical breakthrough in the process of converting moisture to energy. And in a sign the labour market is easing, at least a bit, uh, the number of job vacancies fell in February. But it's still high, which means businesses are still struggling to find workers. Perhaps Hold on to your job in WA where job vacancies have fallen 15% over the quarter. WA had the largest slump in job vacancies of all the states. When big whale Elon says something, people tend to listen. For anyone who's seen the Terminator, he's pretty much sounded the alarm over Skynet. He says artificial intelligence is out of control and that it needs to be paused for at least six months or else there will be profound risks to society and humanity. <laughs> Struggling indie musos may have found a new way to make money other than busking or, you know, volunteering for science experiments. Perth band Psychedelic Porn Crumpets is going to launch music NFTs next month. The initiative is in partnership with whiskey brand Jack Daniels as part of the Jack Daniels Music Drop and it's going to be a Pokemon Go style treasure hunt that you can play on a mobile phone. Somehow, I don't, don't ask me how, the band gets a royalty, so start hunting. You can find more business news content on thewest.com.au or to see all the data and insights behind this video, check out graffa.com. Thanks for joining me on this episode of Trading Up. I'm Heidi Cuthbert. See you next time.